Hey guys, this is me Nishi. I welcome you all in Coding Mania. So today is about wrinkle detection. So let's have a look on the code. So firstly, I'm loading all the necessary libraries. So first one is CV2, which is needed for image manipulation, loading image, resizing image, or etc. NumPy for manipulation of NumPy arrays. Now you must be wondering why I'm using this one here in image. Like I'm using this library because every uh, image will convert it into NumPy array. When we are loading in it into uh, one variable that will be converting into the NumPy array. So for manipulating array, we need NumPy library, right? And here I'm using uh, ipython.display instead of matplotlib because when I'm plotting image using uh, matplotlib, I was not getting a good color of the image, original color of the image. I was getting some tinted blue uh, color of the image and that was not good. And I wanted to show you the original color and original image. And I wanted to show you that uh, whether my program is really working or not. So now here I am doing firstly um, loading my uh, har cascade file. Uh, so you must be wondering what is har cascade file, right? Har cascade file is basically used for uh, phase detection. So I will let you know uh, about this in detail in later video. So um, this one is uh, har cascade front face XML file and I'm loading in uh, face cascade file face cascade variable and then I'm displaying the original image without manipulating anything right then I'm loading uh, this image and cv2 dot I am read this function I'm using for loading image then uh, I'm converting it to grayscale image right and then I'm um, I'm just detecting whether face is there or not. This function will return four arguments: x coordinate, y coordinate, width, and height. So for that we need for loop, right? So for uh, x, y, w, h. Actually, we need for loop uh, if there is um, more than one uh, face or not. Okay. But here we have one face, but uh, case can be anything. So here I'm using for loop x, y, w, h in faces. Now I'm cropping the face, like whatever, like whichever part of the image is um, detected as a face that will be cropped, right? Uh, because we, we need the cropped one, zoomed one. We can't perform anything on this uh, original image. We need only this part of the image. Okay. Now uh, I'm cropping it and I'm applying the Kenny, uh, Kenny as detection function. So I'm passing that value in this. And here you can manipulate the values uh, and you can experiment how uh, result is coming. Now uh, here I am counting number of edges. So I'm counting by using np.count underscore non-zero. So np is used because this is nothing but um, numpy array. And now I'm checking whether num number of edges is greater than 1000 or not. If greater than 1000, then wrinkle found. If less than 1000, then wrinkle not found. I'm using 1000. Why? Because uh, like our face has um, some edges like eyebrows, eye, eye line, lip line, uh, mouth line, nose line. So that edges uh, can be covered in um, thousand number, right? So more than thousand uh, means you, like more than thousand, it, it will show that um, wrinkles are there. Okay. So 1000 is negligible, but more than 1000 is not negligible. 
So I am passing my own photo here and you can see here output. No ring. And now I am passing another image here. I have used same code. So don't worry about the code. Here I am passing wrinkled face. So wrinkled face is this one. This one is original image. And you can see here it is coming um, wrinkle found. If you want to try different one, you can also try as I am showing you like face. I have another image face 2. So sorry, I have not changed here. Face 2. Okay. So no wrinkle found as you can see because he is very young, right? <laughs> Now, third one. Here also no wrinkles, right? So as you can see, my algorithm is working on different, different images and it is working perfectly. So please guys try this code and please let me know in comment box like it, whether it is working with you guys or not like upload your image and check it out